Welcome back. It's me, Shalise. Um, so, I have never done a bookshelf tour on my channel before. <laughs> um, and mostly because my bookshelves have never been neat. Typically my bookshelves are like stacked this way and like flat and also there's like some behind them and so it's a whole mess and so like I never want to go through the whole process of doing a bookshelf tour because that's a lot. But recently I moved a lot, like half of my books, um, I put them in bins and they're like in my basement, sort of. Um, and so now the my this is my TBR shelf basically <laughs> and all of the like spines are facing out there's no books behind there um so i just figured like i, I kind of wanted to do like a little like TBR bookshelf tour um but it's basically a bookshelf tour because this entire bookshelf is books that i haven't read um yeah so that's what's happening i'm looking on goodreads i added like all of these books onto like a specific shelf and there is 108 books on there. This is not like a specific bookshelf or anything. I cannot tell you where this bookshelf came from because it's we've had it for a very long time and I don't know where it came from. Um, both of my bookshelves. It's also temporarily um, organized in by color right now because I typically I like to organize my books by genre but I just decided I'd go for a change. So it's it's in rainbow or um right now. It's sort of a rainbow. It's my first attempt at rainbow shelves. Um and I have a lot of black books and I was kind of like confused as to where I should or like start the colors. So it's a bit of a weird <laughs> weird thing. <laughs> so but I like it, so it's whatever. Uh anyways, yeah, so Let's get into it. Okay, so we're just gonna use my blue bookshelf as a background here because my tripod doesn't reach all the way to my top shelf and also I don't want to hold it and be shaky, so we're gonna try this out. <laughs> Anna Karenina by Leo Tolstoy. The Five People You Meet in Heaven by Mitch Albom. Leonardo da Vinci by Walter Isaacson. Pride by E.B. Zavoy. Persuasion by Jane Austen. The Miracle Worker by William Gibson. Heartstone by L. Catherine White. By Gaslight by Stephen Price. The Rules of Magic by Alice Hoffman. The Philosopher's Flight by Tom Miller. The Dinner List by Rebecca Surley. The Gown by Jennifer Robson. The Priory of the Orange Tree by Samantha Shannon. The Girl's Guide to Hunting and Fishing by Melissa Bank. First Impressions by Charlie Lovett. You Think It, I'll Say It by Curtis Sittenfeld. Illuminae by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff. The Library Book by Susan Orlean. Arusha and the End of Time by Rajni Chakshki. Catching Stars by Kayla Keenan. Behold the Dreamers by Imbolo Umbwe. Midnight at the Bright Ideas Bookstore by Matthew Sullivan. The Glass Spare by Lauren DeStefano. The Diviners by Leba Bray. The Witchwood Crown by Tad Williams. The Importance of Being Earnest and Four Other Plays by Oscar Wilde. Dear Ijoele or A Feminist Manifesto in 15 Suggestions by Chimamanda Ngozi Adichie. The Storm Runner by J.C. Cervantes. The Girl Who Smiled Beats by Clementine Wamaria and Elizabeth Whale. The Astonishing Color of After by Emily XR Pan. The Last Equation of Isaac Severy by Nova Jacobs. Gone with the Wind by Margaret Mitchell. Napoleon by Andrew Roberts. The Wolf in the Whale by Jordana Max Brodsky. Let the Great World Spin by Colum McCann. I don't know if you can tell that I had to readjust. It's also like a few days later because I had to go somewhere. So sorry if the lighting has changed and also the angle. But yeah, okay, let's continue. The Book Thief by Marcus Zusak. Evermore by Sarah Holland. Jonathan Strange and Mr. Norrell by Susanna Clark. Woodrow Wilson by Louise Auchincloss. Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom by Lee Bardugo. The Joy Luck Club by Amy Tan. The A to Z of You and Me by James Hanna. The City of Brass by S.A. Chakraborty. Unbroken, Unbroken by Laura Hillenbrand. The Lies of Lockamora by Scott Lynch. Heart of Iron by Ashley Poston. The Jane Austen Project by Kathleen A. Flynn. Throne of Glass and The Assassin's Blade by Sarah J. Mass. The Bear and the Nightingale by Catherine Arden. Truth Witch by Susan Dennard. The Wicked King by Holly Black. Foolish Hearts by Emma Mills. Alice Moving Castle by Diana Wynne Jones. Opposite of Always by Justin A. Reynolds. Spinning Silver by Naomi Novik. Eleanor Oliphant is Completely Fine by Gail Honeyman. The Nest by Cynthia Depri Sweeney. Wonder by R.J. Palacio. Miles Morales Spider-Man by Jason Reynolds. The Rocks by Peter Nichols. Freedom by Jonathan Franzen. Gemina 
by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff. The Bone Season by Samantha Shannon. Strange the Dreamer by Lainey Taylor. State of Sorrow by Melinda Salisbury. Lincoln by David Herbert Donald. The Silence of the Girls by Pat Barker. Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen. A Study in Charlotte by Brittany Cavallaro. Pachinko by Min Jin Lee. The Zookeeper's Wife by Diane Ackerman. Mansfield Park by Jane Austen. R is for Rebel by J. Anderson Coates. Hilled by Nicola Griffith. Little Fires Everywhere by Celestine. The Hazelwood by Melissa Albert. My second copy of The Wicked King by Holly Black. Beyond a Darkened Shore by Jessica Leek. Flight of the Silvers by Daniel Price. The Prey of Gods by Nikki Drayden. Victoria by A. N. Wilson. Paris by Edward Rutherford. Warcross by Marie Lill. Catch Me If You Can by Frank W. Abbott. Avenue. A Voyage for Madman by Peter Nichols. Mr. Penumbra's 24-hour bookstore by Robin Sloan. A History of the World in Six Glasses by Tom Standage. Water Runs Red by Jenna Clare. Elamy and the Brute by Alicia Michaels. Daisy Jones and the Six by Taylor Jenkins Reid. Bossy Pants by Tina Fey. The Holocaust Kid by Sonia Pilser. The Heart's Invisible Furies by John Boyne. Reign of the Fallen by Sarah Glenmarsh. Once and for All by Sarah Dessen. The Shoemaker's Wife by Adriana Trigiani. Sarum by Edward Rutherford. The Clockmaker's Daughter by Kate Morton. A Minor Apocalypse by Tadus Konwiki. American Wife by Curtis Sittenfeld. Americana by Chimamanda Ngozi Adichie. The Believers by Zoe Heller. A Gathering of Shadows by V.E. Schwab. My Life in France by Julia Child. Love, Hate, and Other Filters by Samira Ahmed. Nevernight by Jay Kristoff. 1Q84 by Haruki Murakami. Okay, and there you have it. Those are all the books on my TBR shelf. If you have any suggestions as to where I should start with them, which ones are like really good, or which ones I shouldn't read because they're not worth it. Most of these books I, I do want to read. <laughs> um, yeah, so thanks for watching. Uh, I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more of me. Um, yeah.